Uh, hey guys, I'll be doing a tutorial today on how to make a, some very cool effects on Sony Vegas. That they, they do a lot of them in montages for Call of Duty 4 and stuff, so I'll just be doing a quick tutorial on that. Okay, so once you open up Vegas, I'll restart it real fast. Okay, yes, I have the trial version. I'm going to get the full version soon. Open up Vegas Pro 9. Open it up. Okay, uh. waiting for it to open, 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 open. Uh, okay. So, once it's open, you see all this. Um, okay, so I'm going to open up my clips. These are some of my clips. No collateral, 360. Uh, so I'll be doing this clip. Okay. So you open up your clip. So what you want to do is just tab over with the arrow keys until you get to the part that you want. So say right there, right, right there is where we're going to do the circle. So press S, cut it, and come back over here but we're going to need to do some effects first so your effects are right here you don't want to go down and get yes, some transition no, no, no you want to go to video effects first go down to glow go to white soft glow uh... Or you, don't, you can do any glow just bring it down to zero then go to glow percent no go to intensity Everything's zero but intensity and just bring it up to about 1.212. Okay, so we got that. Uh, okay, bring it back to that. Okay. Everything's zero, zero, zero. Okay. 1.212. Okay. See that work. That did not work. I guess that's what I get for trying to copy that. So I'm gonna go back to video effects and glow and go down zero zero. Take away those crappy keyframes. Right back down to zero. Back down to zero. Back down to zero. Back down to zero. Okay. The intensity goes back up there. Yeah, I know it's cool. Okay, now go to if you have a cool, this you don't need it, but it's pretty cool. I uh, this one I made Black Border Pro, but I'll show you how to make one. So just drag it into your clip. I'll go to go over to my clip and choose blurred size. Let's see. Yeah. Uh, okay. Make the size about there. So it just makes a nice little border around it. Color roll to make it black, okay. Alright. Let me get to start off. Okay. Alright, so you got that. Uh, I'm going to drag my pre made one in there. Okay. So you got your nice little border. Um, go back. Now go to, um, okay. Go to, where is that? Like gradient map. Oh, yeah, color corrector. And I made a pre pre made one, just gold circle y thing. Drag down your first one, and it should look like that. Nice bright. Polish orange. Okay. Now you want to frame by frame for some reason. Now it's kind of lagging because of hype, so don't. Yeah. All right. So go to now. Uh, where's that? Transitions. Go to iris. Circle out center. Drag that right there. And now make the second clip. 
it should already be normal because you didn't change it. Um, yeah, you can also do brain brightness and contrast. Like I guess I'll do that right now. That was my dad saying not to go in the bathroom. Okay, you know. Color correct, no, uh, brightness and contrast right there. I'll make it have more contrast because that looks good. Alright, so you got that. Now just play it. And it should look like it is. So it's going to be kind of hard. But, um, okay. So. Go back to your first kill, right? Wait for it. There. As I cut it at the first kill, so you want to go to cannon crop at the very beginning part. Go back. Right when you get the hit marker, right there. No, there. Okay. Now I'm going to add. No, actually, it's good. Over the next there. I'm gonna cut it. Just pressing this, uh, pan and crop. That's gonna be our last part. So, we'll click on the first keyframe, turn it a bit, and push it in. Just like that. Okay. So now go a few frames over. And add another keyframe, and then put it back to normal. Right. Like that. Okay. See that? Uh, I'll show you guys the finished product, or whatever, as a video part after this, just not, not this one, because it's lagging a lot. Okay, so you got, there's your first kill, second kill, right? There. I'm gonna add another, wait. There. Another keyframe. It's gonna turn it, uh, the other way. And push it in. Alright, what, like, a few frames before, add another, make it back normal so it doesn't just gradually increase the entire way. There. See how that is. Okay, that's good. Alright, so your finished part should look exactly like this. Security Charlie! UAV recon standing by. 